Hello, today I'd like to uh, demonstrate some DOS games on my V40 motherboard. So I've got my color graphics card here. This is an actual IBM color graphics card. PC speaker and a USB drive which has got our uh, files on it. So I booted it up and we're sitting here at the prompt. I'll dim some lights to kind of see if we can get a better shot of it. So I'll go to the uh, games directory. And let's run Paratrooper. You can see it uh, starts up just fine. Now just like my other projects, I, it uses kind of the same BIOS. I have not, um, in graphics mode, I have not put a teletype out. So you just get some blurry characters on the screen there. Just saying, press any key. And there we are. This is an 8 megahertz processor, so it's, it's running a little bit faster than I remember it running as a kid. Alright, I'm going to pause for a second. I'll load another game. All right, we're going to do Alley Cat now. Keep in mind it's still black and white. Uh, no joy or a keyboard. I'm going to go as kitten. Any key to start. As you can see. Alright, I'm going to pause this and do another game. Now the reason why I have to reboot between is a lot of these don't have a, an exit from the game. I'm going to do a Beast. Now this one's text-based. If any of you ever remember this game. you got to smash the H's between two blocks. Here's Digger. So you can see we're coming along with the uh, CGA graphics. So hopefully uh, keep improving. Thanks for checking it out.